Welcome everyone. In this video, I am going to share some of the online courses that is very useful for all teachers. When I was working as an assistant teacher in a school, I asked one of the classroom teachers that I was getting teacher certification. What else I could do that would help me to get a teacher job? Since I'm not very good in technology, I'm not a tech savvy, I needed help in technology. She suggested me these courses. These are the Google certification courses for educators. Almost all schools in America, they use uh, Google as their main domain and we use Chromebooks and we use Google Classroom. So it is very important that you know all these tools, how to use them, even though it is very easy to use, but you should know how to use them. These certifications are additional uh, qualifications to your resume that will make it stand out. Uh, many school ISDs prefer the teachers who are Google certified. When you start as a teacher, there will be a lot of trainings. You need to go through a lot of trainings and you need to know your team well and you need to get along with the admins and other teachers and you need to set your classrooms. You have so many things going on. It will be overwhelming. So if you take all these courses, once you become a teacher, you can focus more on other trainings and you can uh, get your classrooms ready for the students. You can focus on the curriculum and uh, get ready with uh, lesson plans and other stuff. It is coming from my personal experience. So I strongly suggest you to take all these courses. I will walk you through these courses one at a time. Search Google Teacher Center and it will take you to the website Google for Education. In that you need to open Teacher Center tab because Google for Education has lots and lots of information. What we need is the Teacher Center courses and certifications. So the first one says start your journey with training courses. Click on the blue tab says begin training courses. All these courses are free. So they have explained everything clearly and they have given step by step instructions in this scroll down and you see this google workspace for education tools it has three courses as i said it is free so basic intermediate and premium let's open uh, basic google workspace for fundamental education and i'll walk you through what is in there so you can learn about organizing your classroom and Communicate with your students and the parents and manage uh, your time effectively, manage student work and manage student progress. They have given step-by-step -step instruction on uh, how to do this, even the assignments. So you can click on get started and it tells you exactly what you are going to learn in there and how many minutes of lessons are these. The next one is if you register, they will send free videos that you can watch for uh, the basic Google Classroom usage and they give um, information about AI, how to use AI tools. So the next course is about how to manage Google Classroom. This is very important. It is a course itself and it is free and they give practice sets also that you can practice and you can figure out how to use these. And um, uh, in-person learning is also there and Chromebooks for educators. It is very, very important because most of the schools use Chromebooks and uh, uh, please make sure you learn all these there are additional trainings and uh, support you get uh, the lot of google tools we use every day in school is google classroom docs uh, the forms and the slides i use it every day in my class so you make sure you know all these so let's open the google classroom and see what is in there so in this course they have given step-by-step -step instruction on how to set your Google Classroom. They have many courses to learn about the basics of Google Classroom. For example, uh, the Google Classroom basic course and getting started with Google Classroom and the Google Classroom tip and so many other courses also. So as I said, again, uh, these courses are free and you can get more resources also. So make sure you are learning all these and you can get tips and tricks from the teachers, experienced teachers too. 
so let's move on to the next one now we are going to focus on certifications all other courses we have seen those are free but you have to pay a little amount to get the google certifications click on explore certifications it will take you to the page where you can see information regarding two levels of google certification for educators the fee for level one uh, certification is ten dollars and for level two it is twenty five dollars so um, it is an online test it is a proctored online test let's explore more about the certifications let's open the level one certification and see so click on get started and it takes you to the page where they give step by step instructions on how to register for this certification it's very easy everything is online so just click on that blue uh, register tab and it will take you to that page and if you scroll down you can see the step by step instructions on how to register for this some of my teacher friends took the certifications uh, it is a very good resume builder because many school isds look for the google certified teachers and also it is going to help you uh, in your everyday classroom activities before you register because if you feel like you are paying so what is going to be in the test so you can click on before you register what you have to do you can check for all these uh, things and uh, keep your computer or uh, laptop ready for the registration and if you are not sure uh, you are not ready for the exam you don't know what will be there in the exam you can start the training these trainings are free these trainings are the uh, courses i have uh, shown you in the beginning so it will take you to, to that training page it is the same page we have seen already so you can take all these workshops one at a time there are many lessons in there so you can do all these lessons and you can see how easy or how uh, difficult it is for you to take the certification and there are a lot of other resources to uh, to prepare for the certification there are videos and uh, there are some other ways uh, that will help you how to get ready for the exam and there are frequently asked questions so i strongly suggest you to go through these questions to get an idea how these certifications will be level one and level two so um, i'm not going to read all the questions and answers to you so you can go ahead and read uh, please make sure you are reading all the frequently asked questions before you register for the certifications there is more after the certifications you can become a certified coach and trainer that will help you to get into the training programs that is run by the isds to teach and train the new teachers that is one of the main reasons why these certifications are important too and uh, let's go back to the uh, main page where uh, we can see uh, more resources uh, so if you scroll down uh, you can see all the resources whatever you are getting for free so as you scroll down this is the one so you can uh, how to engage your students with free of charge lesson plans so you don't have to pay anything you just have to register for it you can explore all the resources that is available for free you just have to uh, submit a form uh, to get all these resources if you don't want to pay for the certifications just take the free courses that is available uh, that is very very useful there is another video on uh, free online courses from good universities and online platforms i have given the link in the description thanks for watching share and subscribe